Hey folks, today is Thursday, July 29th, 2021. It was quite the storm we had last night. Uh, it is now 8, uh, 17 in the morning. I just got off work and uh, yeah, I'm gonna be driving home and I'll just vlog on the way home so that way I don't have to worry about doing it while I'm at home. So how about that? Why am I wearing my sweatshirt when it's 72 degrees out? Because we have the AC running at work, so it actually gets uh, too cold for me. So I wear it while I'm in the lunchroom, eating my lunch. And uh, yeah, keeps me comfy. Hopefully you'll stay up. I have you jammed up against the dashboard, so yeah. And I really hope they don't have Commercial Street blocked off again, because they actually did last night. They were doing construction from noon to midnight last night, which I find interesting because it, the National Weather Service was already saying we were gonna have rough weather last night, and yet they went along with the construction anyways. It's like if you're ending the project at midnight and you know there's gonna be thunderstorms, like serious thunderstorms, why not end it before or ahead of time? Like, didn't they have to like do cleanup and shit at the end of the project? I don't know. Anyway, I just have to hope that uh, they're not doing it afterwards. It just said noon to midnight yesterday, so hopefully they're not continuing the project today. <sighs> I'm going to take off my sweatshirt now, but uh, then I have to take off my vest as well, and I can't do that while driving. Are they seriously Rick rolling us on the radio? What the fuck? That is not cool. Okay, doing a turn. Hopefully you won't fall. Please don't fall. Stay upright. I'm warning you, stay upright. Good job. Good viewer. Okay. Uh, but yeah, the weather's it's looking nice today. Um, so yeah, last night we the storms got pretty bad. Uh, we actually had a tornado warning here in Winnebago County, and uh, fortunately, I don't think we got. I don't think the. I think what happened was they there was a uh, funnel cloud spotted like on the border between uh, Winnebago County and Fond du Lac County. It's like two miles south of some town that's like on the border, so it's basically on the border. So I had to say tornado warning for both those counties, but uh, either way, it was just a funnel cloud. So it's not just because someone sees a funnel cloud doesn't mean it necessarily is a tornado. But if they do see a funnel cloud, they're going to do a you know tornado warning, obviously, just on the chance it is a tornado. But at this time, it's unconfirmed. Tornadoes usually aren't confirmed until, like, officially confirmed until, like, days after they happen, usually. They have to, like, survey the damage to see if it is, like, tornadic damage. That's how they call it. <sighs> yeah. Yeah, I got two roundabouts to go through. I swear, Nina is roundabout city. There's, like, roundabouts everywhere here, especially on Green Bay Road. But, uh, I actually kind of like it. It's nicer than waiting at a traffic stop, that's for sure. Or traffic light. Uh, so, don't know what I'm gonna do when I get home. Probably just, uh, record Let's Plays. Or just do what I normally do, and that's just hang out, because, like, I'm too tired to do anything. All I want to do when I get home from work is just hang out, because and yeah, and I only get four hours to do it, so four hours is not a lot of time to get shit done in between work nights, you know? Especially if I'm saying ten minutes after work. Yep. This money's been tied until my next paycheck, um, which is until next Thursday. So a week from today, actually. I'm right in the smack dab in the middle of paychecks. I'm already kind of short on money. Uh, driving by the park, about to go over the bridge. Yeah, Winnicon Avenue is a very busy road. I'm surprised that the... There's no trains going under the bridge, huh? Yeah, I never did that downtown vlog I was promising, that 4K downtown Nina vlog. Yeah, unfortunately that never happened. Uh... By the end of my vacation, I was just so, just so down because of just different stuff. Uh, I'm not seeing any damage though, like from any from the storms last night. It's not very visible here, but 
I'm sure it was pretty crazy. There was like two bouts of uh, downpour. Uh, but otherwise up here it was just, uh, yeah, constant thunder and lightning. Fla lightning flashes were pretty big. I especially recall it was basically rumbling thunder like the entire time. So, uh, yeah, about halfway home now, I got about, it's uh, commercial streets, and I'm kind of glad they're, I'm somewhat glad at the same time as, you know, kind of annoyed because of the, affecting my uh, commutes. I'm also at the same time kind of glad that they're doing because the road here is very bumpy, like, a spe like it's a special kind of bumpy, it's like worse than Particularly, like, in between Winnicon and Cecil, it's pretty bad. You have no clue what I'm talking about if you don't live here, obviously, I'm sorry. But, uh, yeah, just, like, it's, like, half of the section that I drive, basically. Like, this particular, the section of the road that I'm doing right now, basically. It's just, it's so messy. Very uneven at times. I don't even know, like, how close you are to the 10-minute mark. I, didn't, I don't think I mentioned it before, I, I probably mentioned that uh, when I do 4K 60, the camera only records 5 minutes at a time. Well, on 1080p 60, it only does 10 minutes at a time, so... Back when I did only just 1080 regular, it could record for as long as the camera had space. But, you know, not here. So, I'm not going to know if it hits the 10 minute mark, it might suddenly stop or get cut off or whatever. I don't think I'm at 10 minutes yet. All right, just past Cecil, almost home. Yeah, like a lot happens, a lot of stuff piled up like at the end of my vacation, like not work related, but like just, uh, you know, life stuff. So it just sucks. Oh, by the way, I didn't mention it but yet, but I have a two pepperoni Domino's pizzas. I ordered them uh, Tuesday night, last night of my vacation, and they gave me, not only did I have a free pizza because I had earned enough points on Domino's, like when you, each time you order a pizza for delivery, you get 10 points, and for every 60 points you get a free pizza. So I got that, and they gave me an additional free pizza, just, I don't know why, but like just hell out of the, out of the blue. It's never happened before. So now I have two free pepperoni pizzas from last night. I did pay for something though from Domino's because I, you know, I, I feel like I should pay for something at least whenever I do these orders. So I got a, a marble cookie pizza or marble cookie brownie thing also. So yeah, good stuff. Okay, here we are. We are home. Okay, I doubt you're gonna stay standing if I go over this curb here because this curb sucks. Ugh. What the hell, he managed to stay up somehow. Well, I couldn't do that in the original, that one vlog I was doing on the, when we went to Lake. I don't know. Either way, if you haven't stopped recording yet, uh, I'm going to now because uh, this vlog is over. I just got home, that's all I have to say for today. I will see you folks later. Bye. Love you all.